Now I'm finished unboxing and you can see what's inside. We have one MIP, two tires, two off-road tires, two wheels for the off-road tires, one battery, a stand for MIP, uh, a teeter ramp, and a balancing tray. As you see, there is some manuals down here. And here's a, a quick start guide. And there's the battery for it. And you can see I also got a mount. For the mip. For the mip drive, you as you might recall, so you might know MIP if you might if you not if you don't know MIP I'll tell you. So for MIP drive, you basically can make a coder MIP go forward or move them side by side. It's one of the things that coder MIP can do well. And as a bonus you can record, but today we're not going to do that. So, now I'm going to get into the MIP app. You have to find your MIP. You have to really, it has, it's really important to know your MIP's avatar. Now we will start with MIP drive. MIP can go forward. Backward, left, left, or right. For MIP cans, you have to feed eat cans into the top of MIP's head. Repeat this until it's finished. Now we are going to do MIP boxing. 
Mip boxing is basically like Mip drive, as you can see. But the thing is, you can you have to touch the gloves to make sound of, so you can make sound effects like this. If you do this, it's with another MIP. If if you play multi, if you use multiplayer with MIP, it, you can you can and do a duel. In from it to follow. No, now I'm going to draw a pat. Now I am going to a place stack. Basically for stack, all you have to do, you have to get the balance tray and put it on nip. You have to challenge another player see my screen I put a sample program and to uh, demonstrate and before we get into the demonstration I'll show you all of this so this is events all events are red so I'm going to tell you a bit about of this program you see it uses event you have to make a program you need events Events, logic, actions, and motion.
Now I am going to start my program. If I it starts with it it's farting. And if I I swipe. Yeah, I think we should just Now I am going to start my program. If I clap once. If I clap twice. If I clap twice, it makes it makes the burping sound. And if I clap once, it makes the game sound. Here is my review for CodeMip. CodeMip is a new programmable robot. You can cut control CodeMip with simple drag and drop commands using the using the app or on your Bluetooth or Bluetooth smart tablet or smartphone. Customize CodeMip's reactions to different inputs such as clapping, hand gestures, and pokes and create a robot that is right for you. CodeMip can balance multiple objects on his matching tray while moving or standing still. You can also drive him over on his Tito ramp. This robot has a fun personality and communicates through motion, sounds, and LED lights in his eyes, in his eyes and chest. His sensors allow him to navigate his surroundings and respond to hand gestures. You can also make him dance or play games with him using the app. This is a great toy for kids learning to program in a fun way. It's a good start for Sam. It's a good start for Sam. I recommend. I recommend kids eight and older to try this robot and you and you will not be disappointed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for Kids Toys Guide for more and fun educational videos. Happy play and from Kids Toys Guide. God bless you.